We're going to get right into it here and go over 10 things that you can do with LensStore and Proxmox. First up, you can install it for free. Similar to how Proxmox provides their enterprise repository as well as their no subscription repository, we provide enterprise repositories for our customers as well as a community repository for Proxmox. If you use our community repository, there's no license or registration required. You can simply use our open source software and don't worry, we won't prompt you for obtaining a license when you log into Proxmox. Next up, you can live migrate your virtual workloads efficiently and quickly. If a replica already exists on the node you're migrating to, or if you're using diskless attachment, which is similar to iSCSI, migrating virtual machines happens instantaneously. The third thing you can do is unlock high availability. LinStore gives you that shared storage functionality, which is a prerequisite for making your virtual machines and containers highly available. Fourth on the list is the ability to design a flexible storage topology. LinStore lets you define multiple storage pools across some or all of the nodes in your cluster. Some nodes may have storage pools with slower rotating drives. Other nodes might have storage pools with faster NVMe drives. LinStore nodes can also be dedicated storage nodes. Or Proxmox nodes may have no backing storage at all and use LinStore's diskless attachment feature. Again, LinStore's flexibility is the key takeaway here. The fifth thing you can do is deploy NFS with one command. Using an NFS share in Proxmox is a great way to make ISO images, container templates, and backups accessible between all of the nodes. With LinStore Gateway, highly available NFS exports can be created with just one command. The next thing you can do is make LinStore highly available, which is something we always recommend. LinStore can replicate its own database throughout the cluster, enabling the LinStore controller to be highly available. The seventh thing you can do is extend your two-node cluster with a quorum node. This node doesn't run any virtual workloads or provide virtual storage, but it effectively makes the cluster function as if it were three nodes, enabling high availability functionality. This allows you to use less expensive hardware, even something like a Raspberry Pi, to achieve high availability with only two main Proxmox nodes. Number eight, expand and grow your storage is needed. Adding a new storage pool backed by NVMe drives? Sure. Rebuilding a RAID array with more disks? Just migrate your virtual workloads away and rebuild the RAID array. Adding new nodes to the cluster and configuring them to be part of an existing storage pool? Easy, LinStore can grow and scale with you as needed. Number nine on the list, use multiple tiers of storage. Different tiers of storage are often defined at the resource group level with unique settings per group. Resource groups can target different storage pools such as the ones we've talked about earlier, Resource groups might specify a layer of cache or possibly an encrypted Lux layer or various performance settings. We can specify different replica accounts for different resource groups. This is merely scratching the surface. There's plenty more here if you want to look into it. And the last item on our list is the LinStore GUI. We might forget about this sometimes. Many of us are familiar with the command line around here, but we do have a fully functional graphical interface with a great looking dashboard. In fact, you can do just about everything in the GUI that you can do on the command line, all while giving you a nice visual overview of the software defined storage in your cluster. So if you wanna try out LinStore with Proxmox, we've got a detailed blog post on how to get everything up and running. We also have a companion walkthrough video, if that's more your style. If you're looking for enterprise support, you can reach us at our website. The links are in the description below. And until next time, come hang out with us on our new forums, forums.lembit.com. We'd love to have you there.